recording. Syncing the audio in three, two, one. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. We're going to be hitting escape in three, two, one. Escape. Now we begin. Welcome back, guys, to Rogue Legacy. My name is Sean. Thank you for joining us here on Turtle Limit. So I haven't played this game in a while, quite a while, um, and uh, I just now recently put up the other two episodes that I have been putting off, sorry for putting them off, for those of you who have been watching them. But yeah, here we go, Rogue Legacy again, I'm going to do a lot better, I actually did a round, as you're about to see, I did uh, the Determined Barbarian King, Sir Gordon, and I recorded that, and then I changed the resolu resolution of the game, and it Close the game, and yeah, so I lost. I didn't get to finish that shooting session. But now we're gonna begin, and we're gonna do better this time. And actually, not closing the game prematurely. <laughs> anyway, so what we have today? We have Lady Faye, the barbarian queen, who has no traits. Interesting. Um, that's quite new. We have Sir Guda the Third. I like the name. Who's a knave, muscle, he has weak limbs as well as um, stereo blind. Then you have Sir Kima, the, who has ADHD. Well, I want ADHD because moving faster is nice. Confirm. As you see, I have some gold as well. I also unlocked a shinobi. That's very cool. Um, I would like some more damage. I probably should. Oh yeah, oh yeah. So I realize you can uh, spam spells. Let's make sure I actually know what I'm doing. Okay. Awesome, awesome. Okay. Um, I unlocked this helmet and all that, so it looks kind of weird. It looks kind of like a. From, reminds me of Skyrim a lot. Anyway. So I gave him my three gold, and we're going into the castle. Such a familiar sight. I've seen it in such a long time. Okay. Again, the really cool part about this game is the random generation. All the gold. Oh, the chest. Okay. Interesting. A very linear room for once. Usually there's a whole bunch of exits. No. No, bad person. Oh god. It's a cool thing because I kept buying health upgrades, so it's actually slightly easier, you might say. Oh god, big sure. Also, my defense is up, so. Oh god, I'm doing bad right now. But hey. Look at zombie. See, I can one hit zombies now. That's so awesome. Okay, what is this? I, this is something new. Hey, that's cool. <laughs> it's like, what does that remind me of? What does that? I, it reminds me of something. I can't even think of it right now. Mm, uh huh. Oh, there's one game. I only play an online game, and occasionally you find these like things that heal you in like the advanced dungeons. And they're very helpful. Oh snap! Night corrupt night. Ah. No! No! Let me hit the thing! There we go. Oh, it didn't even die! Oh, it's a level 5? Why is it level 5? Not supposed to be level 5 when it does that. Ha, suck it. Kill the furniture, kill the thing, get more gold. Ooh. What is this? What is that? That reminds. That's like, that's like a game of tower defense. What do you guys think? There's something... <gasps> Don't, oh, okay. Developers. Villainous. Okay, so this, the developers released, have released the game. Villainous is one of the more risky endeavors we undertook. The initial concept was a reverse tower defense, which sounded like it could be a good idea, but we had a hard time converting the could to wood. Most people who play the game think the process was an obvious one, but lots of stress and arguments were involved in the project. The entire idea was scrapped three or four times before we settled on a final decision. Is it ironic then that to date Villainous so is far and away one of our most successful titles? It was also the most painful. 
Interesting. That's not the game I'm going to test out then. No, I don't want to go through the text again. Interesting. Villainous. Um, I don't have to remember that. <laughs> Hello, the boss room. Okay, do you think we can take out the boss, guys? We might be able to. I don't know if we have enough health, but if I'm smart about it. Let's take it out. Let's do this. Let's do it. I think, very possibly, my shout. Oh god. I do a lot more damage now, I can say that. Oh god. No! Hey, well, we did more damage this time to the boss. And I got some gold. Gold is very nice. Okay, choose my heir. Um, the paladin. Uh, the knave or the mage. So when do we see the shinobi? Seriously. Um, I don't know. <laughs> That's the thing. I don't know when we see the... Uh, I like paladin. Anyone, enemies will not get knocked back. But I'm... I can't like, get knocked back. And I have my shield. I like my shield. Um, nice. I have gold. I do need health. And actually, if you look over here, I can now haggle with Sharon with 4700 something gold. I can now inc decrease the amount of money he takes from me. So instead of him taking everything, I can actually keep it. Alright, so what do we have here? We have a blood sword. The, um, health is money. It adds vampirism. So I think it's a life drain? It's very possible. Um, what else do we got? Oh, I already got a helmet. How much are these? I don't have enough gold for that. I have enough gold for this. Awesome. Nice. Look at me being all brown and silver. Oh, no. No, I don't care about you. Maybe later. Uh, no, I don't want to get rid of 60% of my gold. That's kind of a lot, actually, when you think about it. It's only, he takes 40% of your gold. Well, I mean, I don't know. Um, awesome. <gasps> yes, yeah, successful dodge. Oh, look, one of those things. <gasps> I one hit it. Interesting. Awesome. I made it through the room with without much consequence. Suck it. Look at me being all pro and oh god. Holy How are you supposed to How are you supposed to dodge that? I, how how? I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. <sighs> Mage, the paladin, the mage, the paladin, the mage, the paladin, the mage, the paladin, the mage, the paladin. Wasn't I supposed to have a oh, the paladin? Why not? Didn't I unlock something for the mage though? No. Unlock the latent powers of the mage and transform it all into a powerful archmage. A is to switch spells. Oh, okay. So I have a mage, I can have multiple spells, and I should find one, I guess. Interesting. A is to switch him. Oh, okay. That's only for the mage, because with Paladin, it does my shield. With the Barbarian, that was unnecessary. What is this door here? What is this door here? Ah. Anyway. Oh god. So, what's going on, guys? Um, yeah, I've been very busy as of late with uh, work and junk and school. Like, all of last week, I had very little time to play video games in the first place. 
And so it ju it's just been hard for me to put out any, play any games in the first place, let alone put out content. Can I destroy the games now? So, yeah, I currently, my major in college is hospitality management. For those of you who don't know what that is, oh my god. Oh, okay. These guys can shoot through walls, but... Okay, they can shoot through that wall. Why can they shoot through that wall? Okay, that's not that's not fair. Oh wait. Nope, never mind. No, I guess not. Ow. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Anyway, so yeah, for those of you who don't know what hospitality is, it's hotels, uh, hotels, restaurants, museum parks, whatever. We're pretty much the tourism industry combined with uh, everything. Everything you might think, you go someplace, you go get food, or you get served by someone, that's pretty much hospitality. Oh, this is going to be fun. And so yeah, I'm doing that. I'm going into my third year at a two-year doing doing a two-year program because paper doesn't work out all the time, and so on and so forth. It's a lot of fun. I'm currently working at a hotel. <gasps> I can try out the Shinobi now. Okay, Shinobi is a fast hero, does massive and damage damage, but I cannot crit. Um, plus, now I'm a Shinobi. I'm also going to be super fast with the ADHD and uh, Quantum Translocator teleports and re. Drops and teleports to your shadow. Interesting. Let's give that a try. How much gold do I have? I might go actually buy something over here. Like possibly. Can I? No. I don't have enough gold. No. No. Holy crap! I'm fast. Oh, sprint rune. Gains the power to dash. Is this okay? So for these things, are they forever? Like, oh, that could always be helpful. That's all I have. I have sprint and jump multiple times. Okay. So if I press, oh, okay. So I can now air jump. Now the question is. Does it take mana, and does it last after this dungeon? It does not take mana. Awesome. Uh, so yeah, it's just difficult. To keep up, you know, doing all this junk that I'm doing with work, and I'm a full-time student, and then I do a bunch of other stuff as well, so it's, it's, it gets pretty hectic. But hey, I enjoy it. I love it. Oh, not that. I'm not going there. Oh, I one hit one of those knights. That's awesome. I'm doing so much damage. That is the shinobi. The shinobi is supposed to do, like, you cannot crit. You do a butt ton of damage. If I can one hit everything now, that's just okay. Damn it. No. 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 So, what does my spell do? Oh god. <gasps> oh, that's cool. Oh. What? <laughs> well, that's interesting. <laughs> well, we got to play the Shinobi. That's awesome. And the amount of damage it outputs is crazy awesome. And so, um yeah. <laughs> um, anyway, guys, 
villainous. I'm gonna have to look that up. That actually seems really interesting. And uh, you guys should actually play this game if you have not. I love it a lot. And uh, if you cannot tell, I do enjoy it. As I just said, I love repeating myself if you haven't noticed. Anyway, this is gonna be it for this episode, guys. Um, let us know. Let me know if I'm doing okay. What I can improve on. I'm brand new to this, so uh, please, I, I can always use improvement. Um, anyway, check out the channel. Check out for other videos um, on the side suggestion bar. Go to our channel. Check out other videos we've done. And always, I will see you in the next video. Thank you, and I'm signing off.